Hey guys, just a little uh, support video for the bears among us. Uh, it's a difficult time. Uh, Bitcoin broke uh, $10,000. Uh, it's now 10700 Bitcoin Cash went to um, also uh, $500. Uh, so, so that sucks if you're a bear uh, seeing all the bulls uh, gloating and being happy with themselves and, and counting their money. And uh, yeah, well, for me, yes, of course, I have a crypto exposure of my portfolio. I'll do okay. But of course, I bet big on a uh, um, that this is a rebound and I sold half my crypto. Uh, that's already some time ago now. Bitcoin Cash was around 300 when I did that. And so it looks more and more like I was wrong. And, uh, and, and we go into a new bull market from here. And... Um, and um, and uh, well, I'll regret having sold half before the bull market started. Of course, I sold half of what I bought. Like I did multiply my uh, Bitcoin cash holdings uh, many folds. I'm very happy uh, that I did that, but I could have done better by not selling off uh, half again. So we'll have to see. The jury is still out on that, I believe. Um, yes, the higher we go, the more it sh shows that I, I'm probably wrong. And the bears are probably wrong, but that's not fully true because, well, uh, let's say we, you're just in a bull market and you're saying like, guys, it's going to crash any time now and it goes higher. Uh, well, the higher it goes after that, the more it looks like you're wrong, but actually the closer you come to a crash huh? and the, the closer you come to a actual um, uh, yeah, a correct, correction, strong correction, e even if the bull market has started, this is very likely to happen still eh, that we do uh, test the bottom or go towards um, 10 10 percent uh, close to it like that that's still the case so um, I, I do think it's very important uh, in investing and uh, entrepreneurship to um, stick to your cards stick to your hand if you really believe in it and for that you have to look at the fundamentals um, uh, uh, to see uh, whether uh, you're right or not when the market turns against you. I'm not going to go over the fundamentals now. Uh, I've uh, highlighted them uh, many times in my videos uh, about uh, crypto. Why I think um, it will go down. You can rewatch them. So, so I, I, I believe the right actions are um, to. Um, to not sell crypto uh, that you bought cheaply during a bear market, uh, that's, that was a mistake I made. But equally, um, it depends on the exposure, of course. Uh, let's say you did buy crypto on a cheap, uh, you did a great moves during a bear market and now 90% uh, exposed and, and sitting on, on very nice gains. Yes, I do believe it's smart uh, to um, sell some off uh, and uh, invest in something that's not... Uh, that's not related to uh, crypto, um, such as Tesla. I uh, strongly believe it's a great investment. Uh, just in case, uh, indeed, that this is only a rebound, we go to a new low, that's good by four, uh, even good by eight, uh, that will be quite something. Uh, in alts, good by uh, 10 at least. Uh, if, if, if that happens, um, then, uh, then, and in the meantime, something like Tesla doubles, or, and you put some leverage up, you, you, you fourfold your money. That's a huge difference where you could be in one year from here. Um, uh, and, and, and if you have a very large crypto exposure and you do such a move, yeah, then still, uh, if you're wrong and crypto goes into a new bull market from here, there are no serious corrections, well, you're still good. Eh? Uh, so, so that's my strategy. That yes, I do bet on two horses uh, most of the time, um, uh, just to be sure that um, yeah uh, things go well for me, and um, and so that's what I do today. I can recommend to do that to other people too, uh, especially today. Um, you get I think great great money for crypto, uh, but of course it all depends on your exposure. If you're underexposed post or fairly exposed then of course you don't do that but if you're overexposed i think that's a great move thanks for watching bye